Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for sign of Aquarius, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Aquarius. If you'd like a personal reading, sound healing session, or tarot class, all that will be in the description down below, as well as a bunch of other things there for you to go ahead and go check out. So Aquarius, let's see what we have for you. I mean, you may be dealing with the King of Cups, it keeps wanting to come out. That's Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We have you connecting with the Earth Mother, Aquarius. Alright, it may be a little bit chilly, a little bit cold. But look, we have the sun coming in to warm things up, Aquarius, and you are about to be very blessed. We have someone here that misses you, or you're missing someone. We have the Hermit. Maybe you have Virgo placements in your chart, or there's one around you here, but I feel like you've gone within Aquarius. You're focusing more on your spirituality, you're focusing more on yourself. All right, and we have someone here that's very burdened, Aquarius. You may have walked away from the burdens. You may have walked away from somebody. You're being guided, Aquarius, being guided in a direction that you are supposed to go. And I feel like there may have been someone that you walked away from that misses you. But I feel like you're about to, excuse me, get a bunch of blessings. We have you here, Aquarius. You could be writing something down, or studying, taking notes, Aquarius, or maybe contracts coming up for you that you could be guided towards. All right, look, we have something coming in money-wise. Can be contracts coming up for you, Aquarius, and it feels like this is going to be a very magical opportunity. So we have the rainbows, we have the fairies, we have a new beginning. This is a new beginning. This contract coming up for you. Maybe it comes as a surprise, Aquarius. Look at that page of cups. It's like boom, surprise. Three of Swords, which I don't like. Three of Swords is usually a card of heartbreak. There's someone here that wants to invest a lot into you, Aquarius. It can be relationship-wise. This person may be trying to manifest you, or you're trying to manifest them, or something along those lines. It feels like they want you, Aquarius, and they may be a part of your soul family, but I feel like this person... You're going to be coming together with somebody where... It's like, I feel like this person's part of your soul tribe, Aquarius. You could have a family together, or you already have family, or whatever. But either way, I feel like this is a person It doesn't really seem that bad, to be honest. I don't like the Three of Swords, though, so we're going to have to clarify that. Why is the Three of Swords there? Some of you, this person that you're coming together with, they can be Pisces, we have Gemini, we have Taurus, we have the Hierophant, but we do have a lot of water. Just clarify Three of Swords. Falling out here, Aquarius. What do we have? We have a traitor. So there's someone here that has betrayed you. We have chariot reverse, four of pentacles reverse. So whoever betrayed you is not moving forward towards you, Aquarius. It's someone that you. It's not the person you first think of when I when I'm saying this to you. All right, Aquarius. But you're single. You're independent from this. So there was someone here that betrayed you, but I feel like they're not going to be approaching you, Aquarius, and you're kind of independent from that situation. All right. So. We have fairies coming out in your reading. Let's go grab one of those cards. We 
have the magic card. Like I said, it's going to be a very magical time for you, Aquarius. Magic has a way of touching the heart and drawing power from the soul. Aquarius. Okay. So, let's go grab our magician card. We have the Page of Pentacles. We have Page of Swords. We have a lot of youthful cards here. Bunch of pages. Young people, children around you here. But we have someone here who's very fascinated with their work. Someone here making potions. We have a Queen of Cups. We have Water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But we do have someone here that is very healing. I don't know if you have water placements in your chart and you are a very healing person, or it could be someone around you. All right, we have the Four of Swords, Aquarius. We have the Three of Pentacles. Been very hard at work here. It looks like we have a Chariot. Normally this would represent Cancer, but I feel more like Leo because we have the Lions in, in the Chariot, right? And Lions represent Leo. And we also have 444 on the Chariot. Aquarius, but it feels like you're ascending here. We have the cosmos in the background, Aquarius. You're ascending upwards, Aquarius. So it feels like you're a very healing person, a very magical person. You're doing a lot of work here, Aquarius, a lot of spiritual work, and you're ascending upwards. And I feel like you're going to get rewarded for that, Aquarius. We have the Seven of Cups. It's, again, it's almost like a family setting around you. See, with that Ten of Cups, see, all these pages, Aquarius, it feels like a family setting somewhere around you, right? Family. Family is around you. So, Aquarius, as all I have for you, if you want to see more content for your sign, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Aquarius. Goodbye.